Today we use cabbage and eggs. Let's share a delicious meal with you. Guaranteed that you have never eaten like this. Neither fry nor cook. It tastes crispy. It's fragrant and delicious. Take a bite and leave a mouthful of fragrance. Both the elderly fragrance. and the children like to eat very much. Next, I will share the detailed method with you. Let's take a look. First, we prepare about 200 grams of Pour flour. Pour into large bowl. Add a small amount of salt to it. Then stir well with chopsticks. Adding salt can increase the gluten of flour very well. Then we use chopsticks to draw a line in the middle. Divide the flour in two. We will perm half of the noodles with boiling water. Mix the other half with cold water. Mix the noodles with cold water. Can make the pasta more soft and strong. And then mix them all together. Stay to form cotton wool like this in the video. That's it. Then you knead it into a dough. Knead it into a ball and put it on the chopping board. Give it a little more rubbing. And you roll it into strips. Then cut it into evenly sized dough. Then knead each small dough into a small dough. After all kneading, let's prepare another plate. Pour in a spoonful of oil. Put the kneaded dough on a plate. Then use a brush. Brush the dough with cooking oil. Then cover with plastic wrap. Put it aside and wake up for half an hour. Prepare a handful of dried fungus then and pour put in it a little in a bowl. more warm water. Add a spoonful of sugar. Add another spoonful of flour. Then you grab it and mix it well. Because fungus can't soak for Adding a long white time. sugar can promote the forming of fungus. Flour can also absorb dust and impurities from At the this surface. Time, we will prepare cabbage. Cut it in half. Cut it off with a knife. Hard heart in the middle. And then you slice the cabbage. Cut and put in a larger bowl. Then add a spoonful of salt to the bowl. Add a little more water to cover the cabbage. Wash the cabbage thoroughly with light salt water. After washing, control the cabbage Remove with water. and put on the cutting board. Then continue to cut the cabbage into minced cabbage. Cut it all up and put it back in the big bowl. Add another spoonful of salt, then mix well with chopsticks. Stir well and let marinate for 10分钟 use. Next, prepare a peeled and washed carrot. First, slice it up. Then I cut it into filaments. And then chop them into little cubes.
Cut it all and put it in a large bowl. Prepare some shallots. Cut it into scallions. After cutting, put it together with the carrots. At this time, our fungus has also been soaked. Wash it in flour water first. Then put clean water. Just give it a little more scratching and washing. Later, I learned to soak fungus like this. Not only is time and short and clean and hygienic. Boil water in a pot. Pour the washed fungus into the pot. Flip it with a colander to cook the fungus. After cooking, remove the fungus with a colander. Put it on the cutting board. Then cut the fungus into small pieces. After it's all cut, put it in a large bowl as well. At this time, the cabbage also kills a lot of we moisture. We pour it into the gauze. Wrap the cabbage in gauze. Squeeze out the excess moisture inside. The cabbage tastes crispier. Also pour into a large bowl. Next, whisk two us eggs into the bowl. Add a pinch of salt, a little white vinegar to remove the fishy Stir smell. well with chopsticks. Just stir until you provoke it with chopsticks. Add a little cooking oil to the pot. After the oil is hot, pour the eggs down. Use chopsticks to keep sleeping eggs away. In the state where the eggs are not set, for sleep loose eggs, so the particles are smaller. Fry the eggs into the video and that's about it. Then pour the fried eggs into a large bowl. Add a spoonful of oyster sauce to the bowl, a pinch of salt. A little chicken essence, sprinkle some pepper, then mix well with chopsticks, so that all the ingredients in it can be stained with the sauce. After mixing all well, put that aside. By this time, our dough has also woken up. Pinch it with your hands, very soft and strong. We pour a little cooking oil into the chopping board. And then you blanch it with your hands. And you put it on the chopping board. Spread it out with your hands. Spread out into this thinner dough. Then pour our prepared filling onto the dough. Then wrap it from both sides by hand. The package is imaged in the video and that's it. Then prepare a pan or an electric cake pan. Add some cooking oil. Then use a brush to brush the oil evenly. We put the wrapped egg cabbage patties in the pot. Press it lightly with your hand. Form into pies. When placing it, separate it a Prevent little distance. Adhesion. Then turn on low heat and fry slowly. During the frying process, we use a small brush. Brush a layer of cooking oil on the surface of the cake. Fry one side until set. Push it with a shovel. Prevent sticky cake. Fry until one side is Flip set. Flip it over and fry the other side. While sizzling oil, it smells so good.
We press the egg cabbage cake like this. Slowly fry over low heat the inside. Turn him over more. Just fry until golden on both sides like this. Close the window now. Otherwise, the lady next door will come and eat again. Finally, the capital is as golden as Yellow in the and video. crispy. You can put it on a plate. The egg cabbage cake made like this. Golden and attractive color. Looks like an appetite. It smells really good too. The cabbage egg patty made in this way has a thin skin and a large filling. Crispy and delicious. Nutritious. If you feel good too, just collect it and try it. You won't be disappointed. Well, today's video is shared here. If you like my video, remember to like and follow the message and forward it. See you in the next video. Thank you for your support.